Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back. So this is the continuation of the patch review. Um, basically, they released some new information that wasn't here when I actually did the patch review. I was pretty much pitching in that video about how they didn't they didn't include this information, but here they they did. So you know, I can't be can't be too unhappy about that. So I'm gonna go over it and just offer some thoughts of what I think about this. Um, I haven't read it yet, so this is a first look for me as well. Crystal shop guide, greetings from four blah 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 wait 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 no 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 it's a shop where you can find energy gold, special light dark eggs and many others using crystals. By summoning in special shop you can gain crystals based on number of your summoning. So how to visit crystal or er, er, how to get crystals? You get crystals each time summoning at special shop. By using your astro gems to perform a ten times plus one summon or one summon, you can check the total amount of crystals. So basically this is like a four pay to win players option so anyone that summoned like last month is just you know you're, you're fucked actually I'm 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 feeling a little better now because um, actually like this information just told me that I got fucked harder than I already did before um, on the patch they told you that that they increased the rates of four stars on the 10 plus one summon so you're you're basically more likely to get good shit now and you also get crystals now, um, which means anyone that summoned in the previous month is like basically wasted their their, their astro gems. Yeah, this is this is a giant slap to the face. Um, anyways, but I'm not too sad because I I could have spent more and I didn't, so I was I was pretty much sure like there's no way where I, where I wouldn't have spent that money um, before. And I'm not too unhappy because I actually do, did get some good summons after I, I, I popped some. But the summoning rates were really, really bad. So, you know, hopefully, hopefully in the future, um, I can start getting, can start getting shit now. Anyways, crystal shop items. At crystal shop, you can purchase energy, gold, and legendary secret egg until legend. Dairy dark egg. Wait, what? Until legendary light dark egg and many others. Okay, that's that's some weird typo, I think. Um, energy package refills 50 energy, unlimited purchase, 30 crystals. Legendary secret egg, four to five, 375. This is so not worth it. If you th think about it, this legendary egg is worth um, basically. It's like saying if you spent. Like if I spent, if I spent, uh, wait, my math is really bad. If I spent like nine, yeah, if I spent like 450 energy, that would be the equivalent of a legendary egg, you know, and legendary eggs definitely worth a lot more than that. So I think it's probably not worth it to buy energy with this, um, since you can just do it with astro gems. Wait, what if you? What if you kept summoning with your your astro gems for the 10 plus 11, and then you get a shit ton of crystals, and then you just use your crystals to play the game instead of using your astro gems to refresh? Would it be more worth it to to use your crystals to refresh rather than your astro gems? That might we might have to look into that, depending on how many um, crystals you can get, you know, but. But we're gonna we're gonna have to wait and see. So gold strong box, uh, one million gold, one per purchase per month. It costs 350 crystals. I think this is probably isn't worth it. Um, actually, oh no, I, I I don't know how much crystals are worth, but usually buying gold is is never really worth it. Gleam is really nice. Um, Fire, wood, gleam. So basically, you get three gleams, and they're random. So they're not, they're not. Um, it's not going to be one fire, one water, one wood. So it's going to be three random gleams for 600 crystals. Um, I think that that's probably this is probably really worth it. I think I think gleams are super valuable. They're the probably the most valuable resource in the game. Probably a lot more worth it than buying the legendary egg, in my in my personal opinion. If you just look at the ratio of the price. Um, a high light dark egg, three to five star light dark astromon, six hundred crystals. Yeah, definitely the gleam is is much more worth it. Um, this definitely is not worth it. I think the light dark egg is 
I don't know, it's 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 good most of the time for me, but I heard some really, really bad horror stories about how they um, all got three stars or summoned a, a monster that was for the, um, you know, rebirth or something like that. So special light dark egg, uh, 1,300, that's twice the amount, more than twice the amount of a, of buying the gleams. Yeah, I think I think the gleam is probably the best purchase out of everything. Um, so you get an egg containing a banshee. One purchase per month. What? So there's a special egg that gives you a banshee. That's really weird. Um, and four to five star egg light astramon. So this is like guaranteed that you're. It's going to be a four four to five star light. And then the dark egg, which is a thousand eight hundred crystals. That that's actually a lot. I'm not sure how many you would need to summon in order to save out save out that many. But I guess it's like somewhat um, somewhat rewarding pay to play players. I'm not sure because this is kind of an like it's kind of a premium for the pay to play players. I don't think free to play can really afford to do ten plus one summons unless you actually get a lot of crystals and therefore you can use um, your crystals to to buy energy and stuff, you know, and then you can get more summons. I don't, I'm not sure. Like, and then you don't get any of this. Um, that might be something as well. The Stone Fusion Guide. Um, let's find out more about the Stone Fusion Guide. Unlock, unlock Stone Fusion. Clear a Star Sanctuary on hard. That's pretty easy. Um, fusing stones. At Stone Fusion, you can see how many Star Stones you currently have. Ten lows plus five thousand gold equals one mid. Ten mids equals one high, I guess. Yeah, same with the element mental stones, but the elemental stones cost a lot more. But I will be able to convert my my low dark stones to uh, I mean mid, my mid dark stones to high dark stones if I have the gold. So that's always a really nice option for me. Um, also, really good for new players that can't farm higher dungeons. You can just kind of work on the lower dungeons, and then eventually um, you will be able to five star, six star monster. So that's that's this is this is really good. Um, this is something that I, I thought was missing in the game a while ago, and now they finally in implemented it. The Astro Masters Association Guide. Greetings from. Oh, okay, this is bullshit. Uh, unlock Astro Masters Association. Must clear Lunar Valley. So this is I guess pretty easy. Capture League. Uh, Capture League each week provides rewards for capturing Astro Astromon points. A lot for capturing rare. I swear. Um, and then from some. So this isn't the guild. I thought I thought this would be the guild, but it actually is not the guild. It's basically a, a new um, new feature in the game that focuses mainly on capturing. So there's like a rank based on like capturing different astromons. That's actually pretty cool. That's a, that's something completely new that I've never seen before in any other game. So that's that's really really nice. Um, really excited about that. I hope to see that very very soon. Holy shit. Yeah, really, really good job by 433. I can't stay salty. Like, I know when I first read the stuff, I was, like, really, really salty and tilted. But I, I can't stay salty. They're making the game really, really good. So, um, I, only, I only see the game improving and being better and better in the future. So, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Hopefully you enjoyed this. If you liked it, be sure to like my video. If you didn't like it, uh, be sure to dislike it. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.